What's chewing gum have to do with a cesarean section? It's part of a bigger plan at the University of Maryland Medical Center to enhance your recovery after a C-section. Here's what you need to know as you get ready for surgery. The night before your C-section, drink three glasses of clear sugary liquids. This includes apple juice, cranberry juice, and sports drinks like Gatorade. You can drink more of these clear liquids up until two hours before your surgery. Studies show that when patients drink clear sugary drinks before their C-sections, they feel more awake, less dizzy, and have more energy. Eat a light meal up to six hours before your C-section. This includes soup, oatmeal, toast, crackers, milk, tomato and orange juice, and milkshakes. If you're a diabetic, talk with your doctor about what you can eat and drink. You'll be given two packs of sugarless chewing gum. After your C-section, chew one piece of gum three times a day for at least five minutes. Chewing gum helps your bowels work faster, and that includes passing gas. After your C-section, we encourage you to have a light meal. In the recovery room, you'll be given ice chips, water, and crackers. A bit later, you'll have solid food. We want you to eat as much or as little as you want. You can also bring food from home if your doctor says that is fine. After your C-section, it is very important that you get back to your normal routine quickly. That includes moving around the same day as your C-section. Make sure you sit up in bed and dangle your legs. When you're ready, take a short walk. Sit in a chair for all your meals. We want you to be out of bed and moving around as much as you can. This not only helps you recover faster, but also prevents complications. You'll receive a couple of different types of pain medicine before, during, and after your surgery. This will help you feel better. Using different types of medicine for pain has been shown to decrease the need for narcotics. Once your pain is well controlled, you're moving around and eating, you'll be ready to go home. This is a lot of information, but don't worry. We have a patient guide with helpful checklists. Still have questions? Your care team would love to answer them.